hurting, man. I just want to sit down since I got out of the cage. My nuts just hurt so bad. It took a lot out of me. Did you, after that third one, I mean, did you think there was maybe going to be a disqualification? Were you considering Actually, not being able to continue? Yeah, I didn't even think about it. I just wanted to fight through it. But man, the second one took a lot out of me. But I noticed it was getting tired, so I didn't want to take the full five minutes. So after that, I switched stance, so he won't hit me the same spot. And um, the third one just happened to hit me again, and I'm like, wow, that one took a lot out of me. Because he hit it so perfect, and um, I just wanted to fight through it and keep going. And outside of that, I mean, obviously that was kind of the narrative of the fight, but you told me earlier this week the goal was to just kind of show more of what you're capable of compared to the yes. last fight. Yes. I know it's fresh, but how do you feel you did in that regard? No, I didn't imply, implement the game plan too much, but I know I, I, I gave it a little bit of pressure, but I just wanted to land more strikes. I hesitated too much, but um, I still am glad I pulled out the victory. Have you ever gotten hit like that in the fight? Oh, no, never. Never. I mean, could you, I know you're in the middle of a fight, there's adrenaline, but you could definitely feel the shot for yes, sure. Yes, right? definitely. Yeah. It's old, but it still hurts right now. I just can't wait to take my cup off. What, what else do you take away from a fight like that going forward? Obviously, your first UFC win, that's a big moment for you, so you must be happy on that side, even though you're hurt. Thank God for everything. I think my teammates, Alonzo, I think Ryan Spann, I think. Um, I can't remember their names, but they know. I'm talking to them. Thank each and every one of my teammates. Thank God. Thank my coaches. Thank my mother. And um, shout out this this well, this win was also for one of my teammates that lost his son. And um, my heart goes out for him. My condolences. And you mentioned your mother. I mean, obviously, and you said you know you're trying to take care of your family back home too. Uh, you know, getting your win bonus and stuff this time around. How much does that help you out with in that too? Yeah, it helps a lot. It's a good opportunity. I'm just grateful for the organization. And then I thank for giving me the opportunity. I really am grateful. So maybe you talk a little about this wave of Nigerian MMA that's come in of Sodiq and Kamaru and everything. I mean, what are your thoughts on well, why now and why everyone's being so successful all of a sudden? No, it's just we have what it takes, and I am happy for them, man. I pray for them to keep winning and success to all of them. Is there anything about the rules that you'd like to see change about this? Because the, the shots are clearly affecting a lot of people. Thought you should have been disqualified when they had third in the shot. Maybe. I mean, it is what it is. I don't want to take anything out from it. I just wanted to keep fighting through it, and um, I'm just glad I made it through. Although it took a lot out of me, but I'm happy I made it through. At the end of the fight, you went over and you showed a lot of respect. Uh, did, did you feel? I guess it was accidental then, because actually you... I don't know. I might, might have, might have not. But um, I always show respect. Do even lost victory, draw. Yeah. I always show respect.